Welcome to Hydraulic Press Channel. Hi. I'm Laura. I'm Hanna. And summer is here. It's getting really, really hot. So we have to get some cool drinks. And people in United States, you seem to love ice cubes. They are everywhere. But I think they are like a bit, bit bad solution. Because you have to have three things. Cup, drink, ice. I think... That's a lot. That's a lot. So we are going to turn ice cubes into cup. So then you have to have only two things to have a cold drink. So it's better. That's innovation. And to achieve this amazing result, we have Cupinator 5 million. And we have kept it, kept it out. So it's like minus 50 degrees Celsius at the moment. <laughs> so the ice is not going to melt when we place it there. And then we just crush the shit out of the ice and it's a cup. I have to be fast so the tool doesn't get too warm. Then the lower tool. Yep, that's good. Let's go. I think I cross. I cross first slightly. Mm -hmm. Then we add ice and then we cross more. I, ha I have to add more force. I have just one ton when I'm yeah. placing the tool. I put I put 270. No, no. Oh, no, no, it's going to break the tool. Ice is so soft. Let's say 100 tons. That's like That's good okay. medium amount of force. Okay, now I add a bit more ice. I want to be absolutely sure that we have enough. It looks like it's going to work. Hmm? Okay. Yeah. Oh, uh, oh, it's on that. That's a bit... bit. Uh, unfortunate. Ah, no. What? The bottom fell off. Oh. I think we have to let this one warm up and cool this yeah. more. So yeah. then it stuck more here. Okay, new try. Now the lower tool should be much, much colder and therefore stickier for the eyes. First pre-cross. Yes, 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 this looks good. Great. It's all here. Yes. Oh, oh what no. the hell is that? One more try. Came... Oh, did I... Okay, let's let's have a look. Yeah, it's it broke. I think this is too cold. Mm -hmm. But we do a second round now. Mm -hmm. This is going to warm up. Ooh, look at this shit. Do you know what that looks? I wonder why don't they sell colored eyes in the USA. That looks like American. Mm. Every, every, everything has food coloring in it. Mm -hmm. So why not eyes? Hey. Yeah. I have to patent that idea before yeah, yeah. Nestle steals it. Colored eyes coming soon, Walmart near you. <laughs> Hey! Is it better? Yeah, cool! Wow! Do I have food coloring on my face? Mm, not much. Look at this! Wow! This looks awesome. Now let's not like... Uh, let's go there, this looks sketchy. Come on! Yes! Oh, wow! Yes! Only one thing left. Drink. Drink soda out of this. Okay, I think we uh, maybe overdrift the food coloring. Mm -hmm. 
Do, do I start to look like smart smurf when I drink from this? Okay, there is like some blue on top of Pepsi. I think we have to do also one without the food coloring to see what it is. Maybe the food color is the missing part. Yeah, maybe. It doesn't work without it. You can see blue on the foam. I think there is like enough. There is same amount of food coloring than in like. Some, okay. And okay, that was from the. <laughs> you, you start to look like Smurf. Okay, we are going to make quickly one without the food coloring before like that. <laughs> yeah, mm. this is too much. Uh, but I put this out, outside so we can save this. And now is also a great time to do a DICE project update. The Kickstarter did really, really, really well. I'm, su I'm surprised that it did so well. Yeah, thanks to everyone. Yeah, huge thanks for supporting the project. And we are now sourcing the materials for the dice. And the machining is going to start soon. And it seems that we can start the shipping on April. And if you haven't seen the project, we designed the most brutal metal dice ever. These are CNC machined. They have sharp corners, they hurt your hand and scratch your table, but they look cool as fuck. So you can still order these from the Kickstarter pages. It's still up. And now we have also tungsten. The one dice to rule them all, it's available. It's also the most brutal and going to scratch your table the most. I'm not sure should we launch some kind of like thing to roll them on. Oh yeah, some plate. Yeah, not to scratch the table. Yeah, but uh, go check out the Kickstarter if you are interested. Uh, we are going to probably raise the prices when we have our own web store up. So if you want one for the Kickstarter price, now it's time to get it. Yeah, let's continue with the video. Yes! Okay, and now with the Moomi soda, official taste. And this is room temperature soda. Uh oh. So now it should cool it down. Oh, 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 oh. Hey! Okay. <laughs> Do you wanna? Come here. Okay. It's quite cold. Yeah. Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> it it's weird. It makes like holes. Too hold, yeah. Hey, I think there is like air bubbles inside yeah. of this. Yeah, so this is better. It works better, but it turns you, you into blue, blue monster when you drink from it. Does it start to leak? No, not really. I think we had better luck hmm. while doing this. You can see from this that it's like, okay, it doesn't matter that it's like thinner from here. Hmm. Because it's also broke from here where it's like very thick. But you, you can see there is like, there is, I think there's air pop. Okay, now this leaks also. Mm. Yeah, it's like uh, <laughs> one soda, two cups. Yeah, uh, not very optimal, but the drinks are cool. Yeah, I think this is enough of like ice science for today. Mm. I have, I have, I have finished my plans for the ice seven video. I need to get some really advanced tooling made, but uh, we are not now again working on that project. So subscribe the channel to see that. And that is all for today. Thank you for watching. And have a nice day. Yeah.